Well, the premise of the tournament is simple. Every team, of course, is striving to make the latter stages. That's where they all want to be. No doubt these two harbour very similar ambitions. A good show here, absolutely crucial. And the mood is boisterous. It is a perfect ambiance for the central characters who are ready now to perform. And if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing and turning, which can open up many possibilities. They'll want to make the most of this turnover. Solanke. There is the supremely talented Jack Wilshire. I wonder what sort of role he's going to have here, Jim. Well, he's very versatile, so I suspect he might play a combination of deep-lying midfielder, but also get forward and be a box-to-box -box presence. What they say about him, a player with chance! That's just playing it safe and simple. Shaw. It's Wilshire. Scholes. Scholes. Alexander Arnold. Anything, Jim, to pick out of these early exchanges? Well, I think both teams probably feel it's it's too early for either to start taking real risks. So they're still very much in a phase of, of testing the waters and, and sizing each other up. Well, that's surely a foul free kick. Rice. Always on to this. Solanke tries a shot. Goal! England! England take the lead. No space, no problem. You just cannot stop him. Well, at one stage, he was being body checked, Peter, and then the next minute, it's in the back of the net. That's wonderful striking. So, a breakthrough already. Well, the run has been sold a little bit short there. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. England really can't go chasing this game too soon. Any rash decisions now could see them lose it. Expertly cut out, really nicely done. Bellingham. It's a decent chance to counter-attack. Saka. Foden. Here's Kane. Bellingham. Well, they've got it again. That is ended up in no man's land. Konsa. Foden. And here's Kane. Has a shot! Oh, split second reaction. Really looked sharp there, didn't he? That's very well played. Fiddles it through. He's picked his way through. He's looking to set free a runner. Terrific header. And that's caused a worry or two. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Foden. Excellent challenge there. Uncompromising. Now it's Foden. Nice ball shooting chance! They've done it! And again, they simply do not know what has hit them. And how about the timing of the pass and run? They've worked it before and no doubt they'll work it again. England take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Sure. Can he put it away? They are rampant. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. And that really is so, so impressive. I'm not making any apologies, but I was willing him to supply the finish, and he came up trumps. 
and there was his third and boy he looks the business doesn't he just well he's been the outstanding player on the pitch and devastating in front of the goal what a display what a player England find a position of real strength now to be expected Peter they've gone and stepped it up something they've been threatening to do and will continue to do by the looks of it Solanke and it's Kane Alexander Arnold and it's played forward Rice out to the right Wilshire takes control of it and he's on the move he's played him through Gomez and Alexander Arnold Gomez and it's Gomez played for Stones Bellingham Palmer and it's Stones two added minutes has been indicated out to the left it goes Foden oh it's a promising build up there's plenty of really nice passing Solanke is fouled. No second thought, a straight red card. Players have gathered round and they are clearly concerned. Well, there may be some scope for debate over the seriousness of the offence, but none over its repercussions. They'll have to see out the rest of the game with ten men. And it's Shaw. And he's been shifted off it. And that'll be the final action of the first half. Well, the contrast in fortunes here could not be much more stark. All smiles on one side, their qualities have shone through. But look across the other way, and there is nothing short of absolute deflation. And we are already promptly back on the way. So, 45 minutes to turn it round. And the finish! It's a goal! Static fans delirious. This is utopian. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Yeah, and having the thrust to get there is one thing, having the composure to score is another. As if three weren't enough, this is nigh on utopian. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. He's gone for goal! Well, he caught that pure, but no end product. England were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. Bops him off it and wins back the ball. Oh, it's a sweet ball, that. That's tidy. Oh, he's enjoyed that. He evidently loves the contest. Now it's Foden. Rice has been caught there. It's a foul. Solanke, Rice, well the way this game is offering less possession they'll need to have a, a very good conversion rate, Saka, Rice, Alexander Arnold and that interception was most necessary, Wilshire, England looking to pass their way through Play back to the goalkeeper. There really wasn't very much in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. England clearly didn't help the themselves by the telegraphing that one. Down. It was always going to be intercepted. Oh, that pass isn't the best. If they want to counter, they could do with more speed. He's away. Well read. And the danger is averted. Played long and they could be in here. 
Well, yet another interception and uh, a show of anticipation to be commended. And what a be quick to recover this. It's all a little bit desperate, but it's got the job done. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. And he was quick to react. Rice. It's Saka. Alexander Arnold. Shaw. For Rice. The pass is coming off in quick succession here. Oh, that's fabulous. And that's played in low. No, no way through there. And it's Skulls. That's a fabulous ball. Bounce of passing here, really easy on the eye. Now it's Foden. Oh, he's burst through. Rice. And it's Kane. Bellingham. Looking for the runner. Bellingham. Foden. Bellingham. Oh, he's caught him there. It's a free kick. Substitution for England, number eight, number 15, Solanke, number nine. Oh, terrific save. Number 19, Wilshire, number 14, Phil Foden. Coming on the field, England finding their passes. Number 13, number 20, oh, good read. Rashford. Interesting ball. Gordon. Number 17. That's it! He's got a goal! And so clear that one side are so much better. The scoreline entirely justified. Well, it's a goal fest. And the fact that so one-sided now is, is getting scary. And it didn't take him long. Just sitting on the bench and waiting moments ago. Already he has scored. I think the manager's claiming an assist here. It's become a case of men against boys. In with the challenge. England are certainly now looking like a sorry lot. They haven't got a proper defence or attack for that matter. He is through. And a header! Out the best in the keeper. A moment to try and place the cherry on the cake. Punched away. And he's managed to get rid. And it's Rashford. England can start a counter here. He's got away. England seem happy to bash their heads against the brick wall, Peter. That sent the route forward. It's just a no-go zone. And he's managed to get free. He rises! Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Alexander Arnold is eyeing up his options in the middle. So he's plotting something before playing it in.
Alexander Arnold with the delivery. Shaw in once more. He gets big. Not the worst header in the world, but nothing comes of it. Palmer. He has found the way through. Gordon's header! Oh, almost a sixth. And that's that. England suffer a humiliating defeat. And if that weren't painful enough, there's all the analysis and scrutiny to come. It was a poor show all round. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? One-sided and only one winner, Peter. The players didn't show enough togetherness and it was...